everyone, Miss Mitchell here. I hope you're keeping happy and safe during this strange time. I'm going to read a book for you and I've chosen to read Fox in Socks by Dr Zeus. Now it says on the front you need to read it aloud just to see how smart your tongue is because it is a book full of tongue twisters. So I'm going to do as the book says. I'm going to take it slowly and hope that I don't get really muddled. So Fox in Socks by Dr Zeus. Fox Socks. Box knocks. Knocks in box. Fox in socks. Knocks on fox in socks in box. Socks on knocks and knocks in box. Fox in socks on box on knocks. Chicks with bricks come. Chicks with blocks come. Chicks with bricks and blocks and clocks come. Look sir. Look sir. Mr Knox sir. Let's do tricks with bricks and blocks sir. Let's do tricks with chicks and clocks sir. First, I'll make a quick trick brick stack. Then I'll make a quick trick block stack. You can make a quick trick chick stack. You can make a quick trick clock stack. And here's a new trick, Mr. Knox. Socks on chicks and chicks on fox. Fox on clocks on bricks and blocks. Bricks and blocks on knocks on box. Now we come to ticks and tocks, sir. Try to say this, Mr. Knox, sir. Clocks on fox tick. Clocks on knocks tock. Six, six bricks tick. Six, six, chicks tock. Please, sir, I don't like this trick, sir. My tongue isn't quick or slick, sir. I get all those ticks and clocks, sir, mixed up with the chicks and tocks, sir. I can't do it, Mr Fox, sir. I'm so sorry, Mr Knox, sir. Here's an easy game to play. Here's an easy thing to say. New socks, two socks. Who socks? Sue socks. Who sews? Who socks? Sue sews, Sue socks. Who sees? Who sew? Who's new socks, sir? You see Sue sew, Sue's new socks, sir. That's not easy, Mr Fox, sir. Who comes? Crow comes. Slow Joe Crow comes. Who sews Crow's clothes? Sue sews Crow's clothes. Slow Joe Crow sews whose clothes? Sue's clothes. Sue sews socks of Fox in socks now. Slow Joe Crow sews Knox in box now. Sue sews Rose on Slow Joe Crow's clothes. Fox sews hose on Slow Joe Crow's nose. Hose goes, rose grows. Nose hose goes some. Crow's rose grows some. Mr Fox, I hate this game, sir. This game makes my tongue quite lame, sir. Mr Knox, sir, what a shame, sir. We'll find something new to do now. Here is lots of new blue goo now. New goo, blue goo, gooey, gooey, blue goo, new goo, gluey, gluey. Gooey goo, for chewy chewing. That's what that goo goose is doing. Do you choose to chew goo too, sir? If, sir, you, sir, choose to chew, sir, but the goo goose chew, sir, do, sir. Mr Fox, sir, I won't do it. I can't say it. I won't chew it. Very well, sir. Step this way. We'll find another game to play. Bim comes. Ben comes. Bim brings Ben broom. Ben brings Bim broom. Ben bends Bim's broom. Bim bends Ben's broom. Bim's bends, Ben's bends. Ben's bent broom breaks. Bim's bent broom breaks. Ben's band, Bim's band. Big bands, pig bands. Bim and Ben lead bands with brooms. Ben's band bangs and Bim's band booms. Pig band, boom band, big band, broom band. My poor mouth can't say that. No, sir. My poor mouth is much too slow, sir. Well then, Bring your mouth this way. I'll find it something it can say. Luke look likes lakes. Luke's duck likes lakes. Luke look licks lakes. Luke's duck licks lakes. Duck takes licks in lakes Luke look likes. Luke look takes licks in lakes duck likes. I can't blab such blibber blubber. My tongue isn't made of rubber. Mr Knox, now come now. Come now. You don't have to be so dumb now. Try to say this, Mr Knox, please. Through three cheese trees, three free fleas flew. While these fleas flew, freezy breeze blew. Freezy breeze made these three trees freeze. Freezy trees made these trees cheese freeze. That's what made these three free fleas sneeze. Stop it, stop it. That's enough, sir. I can't say such silly stuff, sir. Very well then, Mr Knox, sir. Let's have a little talk about Tweetle Beetles. What do you know about Tweetle Beetles? Well, when Tweetle Beetles fight, 
is called a tweetle beetle battle. And when they battle in a puddle, it's a tweetle beetle puddle battle. And when tweetle beetles battle with paddles in a puddle, they call it a tweetle beetle puddle paddle battle. And when beetles battle beetles in a puddle paddle battle, and the beetle battle puddle is a puddle in a bottle, they call this a tweetle beetle bottle puddle paddle battle muddle. And when beetles fight these battles in a bottle with their paddles and the bottle's on a poodle and the poodle's eating noodles, they call this a muddle puddle, tweetle poodle, beetle noodle, bottle paddle battle. And now wait a minute, Mr. Socks Fox. When a fox is in the bottle where the tweetle beetles battle with their paddles in a puddle on a noodle eating poodle, this is what they call a tweetle beetle, noodle poodle, bottle paddled, muddle duddled, fuddle waddled, fox in socks, sir. Fox in socks, our game is done, sir. Thank you for a lot of fun, sir. And that is the end. Oh, that was really hard. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that and I hope it's given you a bit of inspiration. Maybe you can go away and make your own tongue twisters. Try it out on someone in your family. See how well they do and whether they get as muddled as me. Hope you enjoyed.